Okay, um, this is going to be my uh, reassessment for assessment three, and um, this assessment is supposed to show that, you know how to calculate uh, force uh, to to gravity between two objects um, it also shows that you know how to update momentum of each object and the position of each object all right so we have these conditions right here we have the mass of the first object its position its momentum, initial momentum, and then we have the mass of the second object with its position and initial momentum, and there's like a time that they started interacting, and a time that they finish interacting, and you have your gravitational constant, and line 13 tells you the time that they were interacting with each other, and it gives you the Line 15 gives you the distance between each other. Line 17 is calculation of uh, the force. Um, and let's see. All right. So, and then I'm gonna eventually tell it, give it, to, uh, tell you the force of. Uh, you know, I guess it says in line 17. It says the force. That um, let's see. In this case, it would be mass two, the force on mass two. Yeah, and uh, in line, let's see. In line twenty-five, I kind of just flip the force by multiplying by negative one. Kind of cheating, but anyways. So. Um, Line 21 will be the momentum update for object 1. And line 25 will be the momentum update for object 2. And uh, we will have a position update for each. So I haven't even, I'll just type this in. I haven't even run this program yet. Let's see. Let's make sure it runs. Run. Should have done that before I started the video. All right, it worked. Okay, so let's see. Um, yep, we had the force first. Right, that's a vector. And we have um, the momentum update for object one and two. That's the next two lines. And then we have, let's see, uh, the position update for object one that's this line down here that's its vector position the bottom line let's see let's print out uh, excuse me print out r2 I don't know why I didn't do that already yeah now it's running Ah, all right. So now we have the position update for R two. Okay, so that's um, a video that shows that I understand the uh, force due to gravity between two objects and how to update those objects' momentums 
via using that force and difference in time and how to update the two positions using initial position and an average velocity based on the final momentum and multiplying that times you know the difference in time